Hello everybody and welcome back to Dot Hack G U Less Recode. On the last episode, we finished volume two, and now we'll be starting volume three. So let's go ahead and get that going. And as you can know, the way I do my videos, if you've been paying attention, that there, but without, you know, you know without the um, new game and everything, as soon as it comes in, that's where I grab my picture from. So there is the thumbnail for volume three. <laughs> So let's carry over the save data. I did do some grinding so that we were maxed out in terms of level. Well, at least Haseo. Bit horn, maiden's hair, body butterfly, mind butterfly. And I think that was 10,000 GP. Now, it is raining. So you might hear some thunder. But I couldn't wait any longer because I don't get as many days as I used to to um, do episodes. That's why they've been backed up. Well, that's why they've been behind, not backed up. So, this is one of my freest days. So, I'm going to try to do as much as I can right now. So, you might hear some thunder, but let's not pay attention to that. When I finally get better, we can live together, can't we? That's why it's important that you get better soon. Because mm. then, you and I can be together in real life, just the way we are in the world. Once, there used to be a goddess statue here. A goddess? A goddess that exists in the world. Then maybe I'll ask the goddess if she would have mercy on me and cure me. So what is the goddess's name? Her name is... I mean, technically, that would have made a good thumbnail for my style, but it also is Laura. kind of boring and plain. <laughs> the key of Twilight. And it doesn't say, like, dot hack or anything, so... The ultimate AI. Morgana Factor. And Harold Hurick. So, what song should we play today? To awaken the sleeping beauty. Aina. As powerful as it was, the Avatar's data drain could not take Ida from you. Your wound was too deep. And the treatment too late. Shut up! You dare lay your filthy hands on my Ina? Yeah. 
Yes, that's right. I'm the one who made your sister a lost one. Be still a little longer. Just a little longer. Haseo. There's no more time. I am. I the will. The epitaph of twilight. The online game, The World Revision 2. It has become a lawless land where PCs who prey on others, or PKs as they are known, roam freely throughout the land. In order to save the Komatoshino, Haseo, the PC who holds the title Terror of Death, pursued a mysterious PK named Triage and finally destroyed him. However, this resulted in the rise of an abnormal phenomenon known as Ida. Only Haseo and the other Epitaph users who control the unknown power of avatars are able to exterminate Ida. Having ascertained that Ida had caused a sudden change in Sirius, the Emperor of the Holy Palace, Haseo traveled to the arena accompanied by former Emperor Alcaid. Through many difficult battles, Haseo grew in skill and strength. However, a terrible price for this was paid when Alcaid became comatose as well. Following the advice left by Alcaid, Haseo relied on Endrance's strength to finally defeat Sirius. Yet, the reappearance of Triage, fought long ago defeated, brought only more uncertainty. In the midst of that, Sakaki, second unit leader of the Moon Tree Guild, began a revolt and seized control of the Guild's headquarters. And so, in a throne room, warped by Ida's power, Haseo battled Adelie, a member of the Moon Tree Guild, and released her from Ida's control. After that, Haseo pursued the fleeing Sakaki and defeated him, only to discover the identity of the true culprit who had been pulling the strings. Ovan, respected leader of the Twilight Brigade, the legendary guild of which Haseo was once a member, and the man who thus far has led him to every one of his battles. However, once Ovan's left arm became exposed for all to see, Haseo understood everything. It was him all along. He was the one who attacked Shino. He was the true triage. Become stronger, Haseo. You know I became a PKK to track down Triage, the PK that took out Shino.
In the beginning, I was certain that the guy I saw back then was him. But the person who PK'd Shino... The one who was Triage... ...was you. You had Triage's Ida sealed in your left arm the whole time, Ovan. You knew everything. You hurt Shino, and then manipulated me. Have you been using me? Since the first moment we met? Um, Haseo, he's not here. I'm such a damn fool. Yeah, I mean, you're sitting here talking to yourself. You like he's there. Come stronger? <laughs> what is it you want me to do? What are you planning? I'm more curious about what happened to that dragon thing that's, in, that's uh, kind of laying on top of that building. Hold on! I won't run from this! And... I will finish this once and for all! Move on. There's so much stuff that happens in this volume too. It um. Why would he refuse help from CC Corp? It's one of my or most liked, matter, but also of one of my most hated. Like the moment Why in the tournament, all I can't the stand watching that cut. Such terrible danger. It's so stupid. There's a high probability that Ida has already spread outside of the world. If Ida can amplify people's emotions. Then it could control the entire population, like a cult leader or tyrannical dictator. There will be widespread panic. What? And here it starts. Where everything starts to go downhill for all our heroes. Yeah. Your access to the Serpent of the Lord has just been terminated. What? There are important mails in the mail station. Uh, let's check Crimson Verses. Crimson Verses. I mean, I know what it is. But yeah, we probably need a new one. Oh, hold on. I mean, it's still good. It's still good, but I don't know if it's, um, if it has a good ratio here. Um, let's see what else we got. In terms of, like, general. I forgot what I was looking for. try this because I don't know if it'll do well without the um, without the, the the shield
Alright, no, that, that seems to, to work a little bit. Um, triangle combo. This combination is complete. Raises units cost by two. Delta combos occur when you have specific combinations of three units, cards, in your deck. Delta combos can have a variety of effects in battle. The name of the delta combo will display in the center of the screen when it's formed. Okay. Um, I still think there's a different one. Let's, uh, let's do a test. And then fight it against this deck. This is the deck that I was using before. But I'm pretty sure that they're, um... Raise your units cost by two. Okay. And then I get one over the snipe. So that's seven, which is great. Um, eight and then nine, because shield versus snipe. No, I think that one will go by correct cost and get plus one. Yeah, still not enough. I'm gonna be healing one point more than this entrance is doing. I mean, I guess it works. So let's see how the uh, the win and loss ratio is. Because before I finish this, I want to have beaten Gaspar because I think he's the top, the last person that you you battle. But let's go and read these emails because right now it's already at 25. So this is definitely going to be longer. Uh, growth of the lost weapons. Hello, Haseo. Once again, it is I, your unseen ally. Did you read my previous mail? I hope you do not mind me contacting you again, but there is something else I must inform you about. Have you experimented with Avatar Awakening yet? As I informed you earlier, you can obtain data particles known as Bioscore by using this ability. As you are an Epitaph user, these cores can be used to amplify your combat capabilities. By using Bioscores, you can cause the lost weapons you received to at sea at the Great Temple of Carleen Med, the lost weapons, to grow. I have sent the lost weapons back to their rightful owners. All I, all I will give you now is the information. I bid you well until we meet again. The lost weapon is growing? I never knew there was a secret to them. What am I supposed to do with the virus cores I can get from using Avatar Awaken? Yeah, I do need to farm virus cores. Greetings, that sale. I cannot reveal my name for certain reasons. Uh, deeply impressed with the power of Avatar Hidden. Oh, oh, this is the, this is the previous one. You can now perform Avatar Awakening. You may use this command to obtain items called virus cores from normal monsters. There is only one point I wish you to be aware of. This ability must borrow strength from your party to activate. Therefore, you cannot use it unless you are in a three-person party. I would be most pleased if this ability serves you well in your travels. Avatar Awakening, huh? Morning, Haseo. Due to recent events, when we have seized activities, many members have left our group at this point. Only Kare and the remaining members are back. Back in Zakova, Moon Tree headquarters have been closed off. Our area data is damaged, and we have had our guild privileges revoked as punishment for illegally modifying the area. Moon Tree was a very important place to me. I met all sorts of people and learned a lot there. It was here I found a reason to live. If not for Moon Tree, I doubt I would have met you, Haseo. I can't believe things have ended up this way. I feel like my heart has gone empty. I'm very, very sad. I wonder if I'll ever see Mitlo Grant again. <laughs> You alone worrying again? Don't get lost in your own difficulties. Your problems are also my, or rather, all of our problems. Thank you for your regular patrons of the world. In recognition of your champion victory at the Holy Palace Arena, we can do the following Advanced Guild at Home, Bragg Epona. Advanced Guild at Home is located in the very back of Bragg Epona's lower town. However, please be aware that you are no longer able to use the Intermediate Guild at Home, Dildana. Alchemy, difficult, uh, Alchemy level of difference expanded to 20. You may now alchemize equipment with a difference in level up to 20. This applies to both Alchemy Factory and Platform. Okay. Let's head to the Sigma server. 
for Kennard's advanced at home in Break Epona. Thank you for your regular patronage of the world. You have fulfilled necessary condition to travel to Break Epona. You may now select Break Epona to two towns. Okay, but here's my thing, which I know this is the concern, but. I do so. Oh, do they lock ninety percent of players out of these towns because they haven't become arena champions? How does this work? And uh, is it that your guild has to somebody in your guild has to become an arena champion or something? A uh, special movie, new movie as a movie player, double ganger equipment. If you defeated double gangers in Hack G Volume One, Hack G Volume Two, and you have Own King, Forgotten Shadow, and Moonlight Faith key items, if you defeat them more than once during the game, you'll attain double ganger only items. They have equipped it when you defeat them with the clearing the game. I think that might be gear, like um, I think it's like equipment, equipment, like uh, armor and stuff. I'm not entirely sure. I don't remember what they drop after volume two. Okay, these are uh, logs, so these aren't um, important. <laughs> that would be the word I would use right now. These aren't important. Let's head to the Sigma server. Avatar Awakening has been added to the Awakening on the main menu by selecting by continuing to use Avatar Awakening, you can power it up to a maximum of ten levels. Additionally, due to this upgrade, you have gained a new lost weapon feature. Lost weapons have been added to the main menu. Also, Avatar Awakening has been added to the main awakening menu. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go here and we're gonna go to Avatar Awakening. Avatar Awakening you has been added to the list. You need a party of three to perform an Avatar Awakening. Avatar Awakening will cause heavy damage to your enemies and will give you virus scores depending on their size. By continuing to use Avatar Awakening, you can power it up to a maximum of 10 levels. Doing so will raise the damage it does to enemies. Initially, you can only power it up to 5 levels, but as you progress through the story, the maximum level will increase to 10. I also need to start uh, raising my scythe. I need another skill because... I am so tired of using uh, that one skill. I did not actually read that. So, by getting the virus scores in general, I guess they will level up on their own. I don't have to use them. Because I can't click any buttons or do anything. Oh, and I should be able to buy new spells and stuff now, too. Uh, should. They should have some here. I need to get enough for all of my party members. That way, everybody can have the spells. I want to make sure everybody has the healing spells and everybody has the attack spells so they can use it when need be instead of just relying on being offensive, even if they aren't good at magic. Just, just a precaution. Does them having healing spells, it, it just can help. I won't always have to have a healer, aka only Adelie. Okay. you got uh, healing serum fairy drop I already have these over oh, turn wings let's get a couple oh well, I guess that's our shop that's the stupid quest shop that it's, that completely bores me. I am not interested in that shop. Oh, but I am interested in this one. See if they have any parts that I can buy. No. I mean, I don't have it. Adds confusion to attacks. Critical attack. Um, I'll buy like three. HP drain. Oh, I can't hold anything else. 
flood counter, eruption counter. Counter with powerful darkness attack when hit with regular attacks. Oh, great. So I have to. I'm gonna. Okay. Increase all skill power and consumed HP by half. That's not bad at all. That's actually pretty good. That's probably one of the best things that I've seen so far. Okay, I do need to go to the ghost shop anyway. I need to clear and put some stuff in storage. I think it's the spells itself that I took out as well as some of the items that I'm carrying. I need to just keep this stuff in the storage until I need it. can use the advanced at home why don't yes. you go and try talking to the grunty which would be great for recruiting all the nubs yeah, and helping them out there might be some kind of event or something half of alchemy and gold extension has been added to the expand faculty menu gp is required for expansions also have the privilege of being a high level kill master you obtain greeting cards oh great you're late boy Paseo, you're slower than a tortoise with a foot ache. Oink, oink. I can't be late. We didn't set any times. Man, his oinking is annoying. It is. Guild update procedures are complete. Oink. I always considered you a little nose hair. Oink. Never thought you'd end up this resourceful. Oink. You have my thanks. Oink. But never mind that. We've got something big to worry about. Oink. Mellow Grunty's gone missing. Oink. You need to search for him at once. Oink. Mellow Grunty? You mean Moontree's Grunty? Hmm. I heard that Moontree headquarters had been closed down. Oh, poor thing. He must be so sad to have lost his home. Poor thing. He's just an NPC. I fail. How did you get in here? Do, do, I don't remember giving Allie, you a card. Where'd you come from? When, when, did we, when did you get a card? What? I've been here the whole time. Don't stand in my blind spot, okay? Paseo, let's go find Melo Grunty. I'm sure he just ran away because of the shock of Moon Tree getting closed down. NPCs run away? Oh no. It's no use. Once Adelie's gotten like this, she won't budge an inch. I mean, you could always say, go find it on your own. All right, all right. That'll just be but considered where are we supposed rude. to go look no, for? No, me, not rude. Oh, yes. Mellow Grunty left behind a message. Let's see now. It reads, I am at Sigma Universal Ocean's Glide. And no matter what, do not come looking for me. What? That's pretty much begging us to look. Okay, then. Let's head to Sigma Universal Ocean's Glide. I want to come, too. Invite me and Adelie, all right? Okay. So, look, Buster, you're more than welcome. I enjoy having you around in the party. You're very useful. But what I need... Oh, wait, I think I have to talk to him. Yeah, okay. Let's throw the firestorm in there. Let's throw all the fire barrels. Tidal waves. Basically, I don't like carrying around spell items very much. They take up space. And I'm going to sell the equipment that I'm not going to be using. Um... Attack, fire attack. I do not need to have these on me. I don't even need to keep them. I'm probably going to throw them in the uh, shop or shop acorn. I don't use elemental attacks like that. Keep the critical. Um, take off the light attack. Take off seal. I don't use it much. 
You take off charm. Plus, my weapons can't really contain it right now, anyway. I am gonna keep this around. Um. I, you know what? No, I'm gonna put them in the storage until I need them. And I can always come back and check. Because this is kind of a waste of space. Because this also takes from my equipment, I think. Well, my storage is full. Great. Oh, no, there's item storage and equipment storage. But. Equipment storage is also full. I'm gonna sell the old stuff. I don't need any of these. Like, any of these. The reason for that is none of them are gonna be better than the lost weapons. The only ones that I need are the ones that other party members use, and I don't. And then I don't need these for the most part either. These, um, these ones, because it, it, unless they're like at the 90s. There's no point in me having them. Even for lower level teammates, I could just level them up and have all sale just uh, do the grinding. See, can we expand um, storage capacity before it's equipable and consumable? Yes, I'll do that and I'll throw more stuff in there. You can access item storage from platforms inside dungeons and their fields. Oh, that's nice. And half off alchemy. I have the GP. Let's just do it. Okay, so now, since we have more storage by 20. Fill up the storage. Huh. Maximum SP, and I think I saw maximum HP at 50. That's pretty good. If I'm right, and that's what I saw. Alright. Um, got a few levels up on the Book of a Thousand. Didn't get a movie, though. Alright, um, let's go and see, where's that bike shop? Ah, there we go. Um, let's see, if we have a better engine that we can use that doesn't kill our stuff. Let's get a hurt acceleration, but... What? I mean, I would rather have the max speed, and we can see if we can find something to raise Excel. Hmm, would I rather have max speed more? Well, I, I kind of need more grip and stuff before I can think about that, so having the balance is probably better. And then getting that ex extra acceleration. And then tires. Yes! Nice! I can't wait to test it out. That's a bike. I'm trying to think, do I want to do Oh, dice, it's responsive right now. Nice, that's gonna come in handy. That's so much better. You have no idea. Like, that is so much better than what I was using. I'm gonna go ahead and save again. Oh, 
I need to remember to sell that stuff, but right now I, I, I just want to get a little bit more progressed. Mellow Grunty's supposed to be in this area, right? Let's start looking for him. Mellow Grunty's got a keen sense of smell. If you get any closer smelling like that, he'll hide. My friends are looking for Mellow too, oink. Talk to three of my friends in the area and they should put the Grunty Tribe Center in here. Any of the other Grunties here? Maybe we should... I've yet to see another one of the Grunties. Ha, <laughs> oh, it hurt me. Which one is that? To flee because of weakness is a sin. Fleeing from reality changes nothing. I only pray that Mellow Grunty comes to realize that soon. <laughs> King Grunty. I probably am still gonna need all the symbol fragments. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I ended up turning around. I am looking 
looking for Mellow Grunty. <laughs> what a crybaby. <laughs> what a wimp. <laughs> you should just smash adversity whenever it comes your way. Let's see. I think there's probably one more place. It's got to be that one down there at the bottom, and I bet you I need those sig uh, signal fragments. Symbol, not signal. Not good. Oh no, it's perfectly fine. Especially when you just you just die. Dang it, I'm only slightly missing him too. There it is. <laughs> oh, that was I think that's that one that comes in and then just does magic. Which was actually pretty good. I think I ran out of those when I when I went to fight Ovon. If I had that on Ovon, it would have been so much better. I think that's the Yada one. Hmm. I'm tracking Mellow Grunty's current position, Nero. So he ran away because of the shock from Moon Tree closing down, Nero? <laughs> Youth is so melodramatic, Nero. He's begging us to look for him, isn't he? Small hill in the northeast. <laughs> We all know where that is. Alright. Let's see if I can do this without getting into a battle. Uh oh, what? And there we go. Area's all gone. They closed it. It's probably all my fault. Maybe this is just my punishment for not eating all of my vegetables. <laughs> you sure this isn't Adelie? I'm just gonna sit right here and keep crying. And eventually, I'll drown in a river of my tears without anybody caring or even noticing. Mello, please. None of what happened was your fault. I was so worried about you. Come home with us, okay? Adelie, he's an NPC. Talking to him isn't going to help at all. Huh? Someone from Moon Tree? I'm so sorry. I've been such a bad boy. I'm so sorry for running away. I shouldn't have done it. Please forgive me. I'll never do anything like this again. I promise. Just for you, Adelie. I won't ever run away. Okay? I see. All it took was somebody from Moon Tree to talk to him. What a relief. Mello looks like he's okay. 
Mello was the one who always looked after the guild members. So I just thought we shouldn't forget him, even if he is an NPC. Oh, I understand. I think it's important to feel that way. <laughs> well, let's head back to the at home, all right? Yeah, because if I don't need those Sigma Fragments and that cutscene, I'm not gonna get them. Yo, get on out. Let's see. Uh, at least it's getting somewhere. Alright. you, Haseo. I think I'm gonna start thinking of you as a straight nose hair instead of an ugly crooked one. Oink. Now, get back to work oink, oink. and earn us lots more money. Oink. Yeah, yeah. Haseo, I'm gonna work real hard and make this guild as big as it can be. I promise. Haseo, we've been through a lot, but we'll do our best to give you as much help as we can. Oh, man. Ida isn't just my problem. Or just Ovan or Shino's problem either. It's a problem for these guys too. And all the players of the world. I really need to blow dry my hair. I, so I got it wet. So now it's like a warm wet. Because it didn't fully dry out. I swear to you. I'm never going to take my eyes off you guys again. It's my job. As your guild master. <sighs> Here. Okay. Plus, Syllabus was a good tank. Like, where you find ways to, of how this game fully works, Syllabus is actually a pretty good tank. And then you get, like, Pyros, who's kind of a better tank. <laughs> Thanks for coming to look for me. I'm going back to the Grunty Village for a bit. I, I'm sure we'll see each other again. If Moogtree needs me, I'll head back to help everyone. So he's okay. gonna go back to his homeland. I guess even NPCs have homelands to go to. Hey, wait a second! <laughs> Hello again, Haseo. Once again, it is I, your unseen ally. How are we faring at the present? I suppose you must have accumulated some virus scores at this point. No, because I one-shot everything. <laughs> you will find the method for developing your lost weapon with those virus scores below. I hope it will be abused. to- oh, okay. You must go to the following place in order to build lost weapons. Mars spent the great table of card and man to upgrade the lost weapons. But here's who sent the mail. We got an emergency. Assemble the ravens at home. In case anyone forgot. Yeah, it is actually an emergency. And I'm not sure you understand just how much of one. Yara's gone missing? We can't even reach him with email. This has never happened before. Pai, don't you think it's a bit drastic to declare him missing? No, it isn't. Master Yara, 
Master Yada's gone missing in the real world. You mean, you actually know him? What? The Serpent of Lore is starting! Master Yada! <laughs> Here it goes. <sighs> Nobody's here. Then who's operating the Serpent of Lore? The Master of the Serpent of Lore. <laughs> Nice, 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 nice move, CC Court. <sighs> nice, nice, nice job. Sakaki. What's going on? Why do you look like that? Uh, Unable to comprehend. Ida? <laughs> <laughs> it's written all over your face. Terror of death. I am never going to die. Sakaki will never die! I will surpass the system. You surpassed the base system, but you still haven't surpassed the Don't system. Don't be surprised. Didn't I tell you I would surpass the system? Have you completely fused with Ida, you bastard? Hold your tongue. Is that how you speak to a superior? It seems my predecessor was quite soft on all of you. <laughs> quite the sign of incompetence. Predecessor? Oh? My records show that you are a member of CC Corp's inner circle. Don't tell me you're unaware of that little fact. <laughs> oh, this is rich! Hilarious! <laughs> now then, behold! Look well upon your beloved pile of dung. Yada! Away from keyboard, as they say. <laughs> He's left the keyboard for all eternity. The moment he was deprived of his system privileges, the coward left the game. Foolish worm! Spineless idiot! He was nothing but a filthy little insect! How dare he defy me! Stupid! 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 Stupid little... Sakaki, stop it! You dare defy me? You dare defy Sakaki? Yes. How befitting, you worthless piece of trash! Stop it! Stop! He's not he's not even Sakaki. controlling the character. It's just a character. Stop screaming. Are you really certain you want to defy me? If you do, you won't be able to save Shino. <gasps> Any actions against me will be seen as actions against the CC Corporation. You see, I've signed a contract with them. I have succeeded Yata as GU's administrator. That's impossible. Nobody told me that. Nothing is impossible in this world. Didn't that beloved scrap heap of yours bother to tell you that? The Serpent of Lore, you epitaph users, and all of the world are now under my personal supervision. That's ridiculous. CC Corp's higher-ups seek the stable and profitable maintenance of the world. That's why they welcome capable people like myself in important positions. And are willing to overlook a few sacrifices. 
Now, this is my order as GU Administrator, Pai, Kun, and you, Haseo. Pledge allegiance to me. Go out and work in my name. Work yourselves to dust to fulfill my ideals. Sorry, but I'll have to refuse. Yeah, I'm with Pi. Let's go. We're done here. So that's your response? Well, it's just as I predicted. But never forget that my eyes will always be shining on you. The Serpent of Lore is in my hands. <laughs> Cool, you just got one glorified camera. Have fun with that. Tad bit of trivia. Yada is Wise Man from Hack from the original four. Infection, mutation, outbreak, and quarantine. don't understand. How can Sakaki be the GU Sakaki? Come on, Pi. Uh, oh. We shouldn't be. We can't attract attention to ourselves until we. Well. <sighs> I'll do a quest in another episode. Right now, I've got to do. Oops. <laughs> Right now, I think it's a good time to call this episode. I still have to do some episodes of Octopath and um, Shining Resonance. Because believe it or not, I haven't really gotten anywhere in them at this current point. Because I'm going to have to change a little bit of the way that I've been doing Octopath. Just because... It takes so much. I, I can't do anything in Octopath in terms of recording unless I put episodes of nothing but grinding. Because that's all I've been doing since the last episode. Episode um, two. It has been like two weeks. Because I've been trying to find a way to beat that stupid wolf. <laughs> but I might have to... I think at this point, I'm, I should be strong enough to fight the wolf on my own, but I feel like the wolf is going to take, like, an hour just to kill. <laughs> so I might have to go and grab the other characters and just skip all of their story so that I can keep doing it the way that I've been doing it. It's probably the best way to do this. But that's not important. That, that's, a, that's a story for another day. But that is all the time we have for this episode of .hackgu last recode. If you like this episode, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you all on the next episode.